Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to resolve the Windows error code 0x800F0954. Windows could not complete the requested changes. The changes could not be completed. Please reboot your computer and try again. So it should be a pretty straightforward process here, guys. And without further ado, let's go ahead and jump straight into it. First thing I recommend doing would be to actually restart your computer as it suggests. So go ahead and actually restart your device here. And then hopefully that should have been able to resolve the problem for you guys. It should have been a pretty straightforward solution. Now, if you are still having a problem, you can attempt to open up the search menu. Type in regedit, R-E-G-E-D-I-T. Best match should come back with registry editor. Go ahead and right-click on that and select run as administrator. If you receive a user account control prompt, select yes. And now, before you proceed in the registry, I would highly suggest you create a backup of it. So if anything were to go wrong, you could easily restore it back. In order to create a backup, it's not too difficult. All you have to do is select File and Export. File name, I'd recommend naming it the date in which you're making the backup. Set Export Range for All, and then save it to a convenient and easily accessible location on your computer. And if you ever need to import back in from the backup, all you have to do is select File and then Import and navigate to the file location on your computer. So again, pretty straightforward process. And now we're ready to begin. So we're going to start by double clicking on the HK local machine folder. Do the same thing now for the software folder. Same thing for policies. Same thing for Microsoft. Same thing now for Windows. And now locate the Windows update folder and double click on it should be an AU folder under here. Just left click on that. And then on the right side, you want to look for something that says use WU server. If you don't see an entry in here, go ahead and right click on it, select edit, and then select the word 32 bit value. Name it use USE WU server. Exactly how you see it on my screen here. First letter of each word should be capitalized and WU should both be capitalized, both those letters. Click out of it, and value data should be set to zero. If you already see this value in here, you just would double click on it and then set the value data to zero, and then you would select OK. And then you would need to restart your computer for the change to take effect. And then hopefully at this point your issues should have been resolved. So as always, thank you guys for watching this brief tutorial. I do hope I was able to help you out, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.